Hey everybody, Jay Marino here and welcome back. It's the true story of Arcane. We're on to Act 9, Chapter 5, Blood and Soul. For me, this mission is hot off the press. I'm recording this the day that Shar released it. I don't know when I'll be releasing the videos for this act, but uh, I'm excited. I have no idea what this is going to be. It's been a while since we have an undead map, and I made some predictions on the Arcane forums on what I thought this map would be, so let's see. After having dealt with the warlocks of the Soul Eater Legion that had tried to level the Dead Mountain and use its debris to unleash a hailstorm against the human realms, the undead Ornassian hunted the Dreadlord Hesrathian all the way to a ruined castle. With all his plans, including the ones that were made behind Kursadar's back having failed, Hesrathian has lost his standing within the Legion. Yet, Ornassian will not be satisfied until the treacherous Soul Eater dog finally makes, meets his end by Ornassian's cold, dead hands. This is exactly what I predicted. There's a short story about the ornassian hesrathian conflict wrapping up, and I was like, this mission is going to take place right before that. And, uh, what do you know? So, let's let's get into it. My lord ornassian, what a pleasant surprise. You, what are you doing here? I beg your pardon. Why, of all servants of Eridon, do I have to meet you here? Because we were meant to be here, of course. We were tasked with finding a place for the Lanier Nexus outside of the Dead Mountain. This castle seemed adequate. To expand the Divine One's influence, you understand. Indeed, most intriguing. I cannot remember the Master ever having ordered any other Nexus to... Oh, we haven't seen Galarith for a while. She's lying. The Master never ordered such a thing. She's just here to increase her own power by adding the corpses of the ruined castle to her ranks. A most serious and unjustified accusation, my lord Onassian. I would never abuse the name of the Divine One in such a manner. Take your forces and get out of here before I rip your lying tongue out and feed it to your spider pets while grinding your bones to dust and having your misbegotten kind consume them like they were that black lotus of yours. Surely you must be jesting, my lord Onassian. We're both loyal servants of the Divine One. Your hostility is most uncalled for. I neither see Eridon around, nor do I hear a voice in my head telling me not to kill you. If things had gone my way, I would have eradicated your entire race. Your kind is twisted and treacherous. You deserve naught but death. True? True? Now then, are you certain you wish to continue testing my patience? Very well, my lord Onassian. I will follow your wishes, for I know better than to threaten my allies. Just be gone already. Ah, I should have just killed her. Marvelous, just marvelous, my lord Ornassian. Just what kind of role play were you two playing there? Demon lord and slave? Maya, and just what are you doing here? Why, well, I'm sure you prefer my presence over that dark elves, don't you, Ornassian, my dear? You didn't answer my question. Well, darling, after the Bone Lords told me to leave Sari, I was bored and decided to hunt some demons and their slaves. And taking some prisoners on the way, of course. There's nothing quite like having some living all for yourself. Hmm. Right. So you're basically here out of boredom. Of course, darling. What good is on death if not to entertain oneself? Isn't that why you're here? You and I have very different ideas of what entertainment means. Naturally, darling. Either way, our dear Pentis has set up three bases outside of the castle. Before you told her to leave in such an oh-so-splendid way, I will take one of those for myself and have some fun while you do whatever you want to do, my dear Onassian. Bah, suit yourself. Marvelous. This is the beginning of a most fashionable partnership, my dear Onassian. Now let's hunt some demons, shall we? I hope to get some prisoners. Perhaps they have their slaves with them. Hmm. Obedient prisoners. Tepid pause. That woman would put some succubi to shame. Ooh, undead Urshan! Now I have it! The fingernails of a succubus! That would... That's what her teeth could be improved with. So we have multiple weirdo allies, it seems like. My army scattered. My lieutenant's dead. My plan's ruined! I... I've lost everything. No, I won't let the undead get me now. Not after all these centuries. Ibira hasn't won this game, and neither have those corpses. Tepid pause. Yes, I have no other choice, it seems. I'm already an outcast. Ibira's made me one. So be it, then. Mm -hmm. 
Necromancy, Hisrathian? Interesting. Does Cursor know about this little hobby of yours? A demon using the magic of the great enemy. How ironic. I studied the knowledge of necromancy, yes, in order to look for a weakness in Aradon's control over his minions. I had no intentions of ever using it myself like this, but I am left with few options. Both you and Ibira have ruined all my plans. Despite such fierce enemies, you two are a surprisingly efficient team. Do not mention my name in the same breath as hers, Hesrathian. After I strangled you to death with your own spine, she is next. I might even use your spine for it. You'll have to rip it out of me first, Ornassian. I've sullied myself by using necromancy. I will break through your pathetic armies and then go and take out Ibira myself. Even if Lord Cursedar executes me for using the magic of our enemy, I'll make sure to take her with me. Prepare to die, Soul Eater Dog. No walls or armies can save you from my wrath. You and Cursedar turned on me and I died because of that. Now I will return the favor. We've withdrawn from our forward bases, mistress. Shall we leave now? No. No. You will stay here, Mir Mirazil. Mirazil? I've endured this male's insolence for long enough. Ever since he introduced us to the Divine One, he's become irrelevant. If it's war he wants, then he shall have it. What are your orders? Gather your forces and attack this male and his underlings. Destroy this destroyer. I have other matters to attend to. It hurts to even read his name, you know? <laughs> I'm your humble servant, mistress. But isn't Ornassian a, a servant of the Divine One? If the Divine One did not intervene to protect us from him, then the Divine One won't protect him either. Remember, unlike him, we are the chosen servants of the Divine One. He is just a male demon. A slave. Bring me his head, Mirazil. Prove your worth to me. Of course, as you wish, mistress. I'm not foolish enough to fight Arnassian directly. I've seen him in battle. In an open confrontation, he might actually win. If he kills Mirazil, then so be it. She's been getting too popular for my liking lately. No matter who wins this conflict, I gain something from it, and can later deny my involvement. I will admit it would be quite liberating not having to pretend to be a humble servant anymore when talking to that pathetic winged male demon or his disgusting male insectoid friend. Don't you ever talk about Harun Talkazor that way. How dare you! Destroy the base of Hisrathian's forces green. We have Galarith. It's been a long time. Look, before we do anything, just make a bunch of dudes for lumber. Over here. Looks like we have allies on both sides. You start this mission with Ornassian's leadership bonus already unlocked. Ooh, undead forgotten because we've got uh, Ardaz Nexus, it looks like, as part of our folks. We have Kazar Kez Nexus. And the flesh cutter is Ardaz. Undead demons. Death Lord? Since when? We can just build those, huh? Okay. So we have a mix of Ardaz and... Uh, and Kazar. I'm tempted to just kind of look. Well, it looks like we have to siege a castle of some sort. I mean, anytime there's a castle, it's, you know. It's going to be one of those. So I'm just. I'm tempted to. Yeah, let's just poke in here and see what we're dealing with. Can we do something like this? Let's go ahead and get our abilities. I'm just getting rid of these things up top here so we don't have to worry about them later. Um, zap them. Kill that thing up there. Okay, well, early progress has been made. I was curious, I just wanted to dip in here and see if there was a base because we want to look for a, a second gold mine because being on one gold mine early is pretty rough. Let's get an obsidian statue and some meat wagons, and again, our goal is to just look for somewhere to go. With uh, with Ornassian's bone eye being our default, it's I think we're gonna want to focus on just these death guards are just straight up good. They're just good. Let's maybe go out behind our base and look. So the Lanier Nexus is here somewhere as our uh, ally slash enemy, but mostly enemy, right? Let's see. Let's get a second slaughterhouse. 
Twin Dragons. I remember these from the the Fresh Breeze map. Fallen Angel. That sounds cool. Can learn Angel Tears. Sounds cool. Let's get one. The trees move. Uh, again, I'm just looking around. This is probably... We might not be ready to attack a base, but I'd like to find where one is and maybe look for a gold mine of some sort. Ah, okay. Demon slaves. We can... Hardly worth my time. We can poke in. We can do something like this. I could do no other. Okay, they're they're coming in. For nasty, you don't need to be just running into them like that. Use your ultimate, Galarith. It's that super chain lightning. Get these guys back here. Is there even a hero in this base? I mean, this is one of those situations where it's kind of like just try it. And I'm I don't regret just trying it because this seems this seems pretty good. Let's rally to Galarith, I guess, and let's get up there. Though I'm concerned we're gonna get attacked on the other end of this. There is a gold mine here. Yeah, and then this he can just do the he can do the unholy regen. We mix him in with some obsidian statues. Help fountain over there. Can we make more of these invaders? Purge and mana burn, that's fine. What else can Galarith do? It's like basically Blizzard, but it's Plague and Hex. Okay. Okay, you just go ahead and focus down the structure. Galarith's doing great, because he is Galarith the Great. Our flesh cutters. The thing with the flesh cutters, I'm wondering, is like, is it worth making those over the just our normal demons. We'll have to compare the stats, because the Death Guards are presumably cheaper. 240, 260, but also, well, the, the supply difference is the big is the big difference here. Yeah, we'd have to compare some stats. Okay, get that and that, and let's go ahead and grab a worker. Because the sooner we take this, the better. We can spread some blight. I am a little scared being away from my base this aggressively. Who even are our allies? Okay, so we've got Ro here, Nexus, with Lady Maya over here, and then this is just straight up Kezar Nexus with Undead Urshan, Skull Demon. I remember him from when we uh, broke the Siege of Dead Mountain. That was a that was a cool map. Ooh, not you though. Meat wagons get down there and destroy that. Okay, well, that was a relatively easy early base down. I feel like we should explore the entire upper right and left behind our base before we try and push into the castle proper. Because, I mean, again, if it's one of those... If it's one of those big siege maps, then we should... We should over-prepare and then try and dive in and do some stuff in, like, one fell swoop. We also have some pretty powerful air units. Where I made some of those... Yeah, Fallen Angels. Increased damage by 20%. That's real good. That's really good. Okay, let's uh, let's go hang out by the fountain. Actually, everyone's at full health. We don't need to do that at all. Um, let's go back to base. Maybe build some towers up here. We're probably going on some towers over here just in case. I don't know where the dark elves are. Are they wouldn't be in the fortress, would there? Would they? I wish That I do not know. Okay, health. Um, do I have a sacrificial pit? Because it would probably be good to not a lot of lumber in here. Probably gonna have to move down here. We need blight near some trees. Over here, or maybe this. Do we want to do twin dragons? They're pretty cool. Should I keep this? I also feel like I should keep this roll going. Let's, I mean, let's go and look around in the upper left. I'm just sort of curious, but I'm afraid of attacks that are going to hit my, the front of my base. And I don't have the income to spam towers because we have a very advantageous ramp here. So does the enemy, though. Okay, this has to be them because there's blight. Attack by dark elves. I knew they couldn't be trusted. Tear them apart. Destroy them all. Okay, well, I'm not... I'm not... Well, I know that they're there. 
So, there's that. Um, what do we need to break through that? We have twin dragons coming up. Maybe another death lord? Don't be we might as well move in and Something be prepared to destroy them. The faster we do it, the better. Again, in these arcane maps where you test, you like try to be aggressive early, if it works, then it's the right choice. But it has My to Lord work. <laughs> it's worth trying. Okay, we're going to get some more gold from this as well. Man, if we get it, the problem is they're going to attack us through our front door and then everything, all hell's going to break loose, you know? Okay, let's attack into these random spirit towers here. Just sort of get rid of these. Let's stay together. Again, a lot of random outlying stuff. Upsetting the mist just was a mistake, Dreadlord. Hang on, I'm busy. I'm busy. I see her in there. We'll read the taunts in a moment. You know how it goes. We can, we can put her, we can hex her, I guess. Move in. Make some more death guards. We seem to be doing okay. I think. Twin dragon, get in there. We need you. Hang on, mass heal me? Yeah, I think we're winning. I think we're winning. Asrathian's underlings, okay, no problem. And then, yeah, once we get this fully saturated, my heroes are in great shape. My artil one of my artilleries is alive. Let's let's just push push into the base. Push in. We'll get another meat wagon. And then these guys do chaos damage. Not messing around with them. Just, just zap them. Yeah, perfect. There's nothing to repair anymore, buddy. Oh, there is. He's a genius. Okay, move on in. You do... Siege damage to buildings, I think? Okay, this was, again, a huge risk to take. But feels right. Now, I'm very vulnerable at home. And I kind of wanted to do this before I left, but... I think we gotta, you know, we had to try and make a move. I'm gonna leave a few units at home as we continue to do this. Can I just stick with it? Just kill this guy? Girl. <laughs> and then move in over here and heal me. And death coil me. Wait, did it did he not get hit? Why did he? That man must have targeted the wrong the wrong person. Okay, one more there. I'm just trying to snipe these these towers. There and there. They're rebuilding everything behind on the back end of all this. Okay, nice. Now let's go for the let's go for the black citadel and see if we can basically just shut them down. Good work, good work. Kill that guy. Keep making death guards at home. We have some income for it now. Oh, okay. Uh, the timing, the timing could have been better. Crown of Kings? I'd love to. Uh, I think we can get rid of the pendant now. Let's pick that up. Okay, problem is, we didn't fully destroy this base, but I think we have to take my heroes and go back. Okay, these workers, I guess, run them up here. We'll we'll have to build uh, another town hall further out so that I can get a graveyard further out. Or we can just return straight to the town hall. Don't worry, we're coming. It's uh, We can rebuild that. We have another one. It's fine. Okay. 
Okay, workers, idle workers, idle workers. Get zapped. Waiting for Galareth's ult as well. Ornassian pretty good when he's got some good items on him. Okay, let's rebuild. Did we get cleaned up here? Mostly. Not completely. Sorry, Twin Dragon. Uh, this faction is out. They just have some flyers we have to deal with. Oh, animate dead in there and vulnerable. All right, heroes, we're going to send you back here. And we just got to build stuff. Never mind, heroes, we're not sending you back there. This isn't completely cleaned up. Almost. Okay, pretty intense start. Oh, really? This is what you're choosing to do? You fools. Okay, we're, we're gonna get this stuff set back up, don't you worry. And you know what? You can be a Halls of the Dead. Oh, that's a man. Yeah, that's a mana fountain. Okay. Okay, and it, we do want to try to clean this up before we get attacked again. Never mind, they're here again. That anime dead is a problem. Sir Oswald. Zap him. Galareth is stuck because he's huge. He's too big. He's a big, big boy. Okay, hang it in there, buddy. Again, we were doing so well. Okay, we're back on attempt number two. And the only difference this time is I didn't waste time going into the fortress. I just went straight for that demon slave base because it was incredibly easy to destroy. And uh, it went way, way, way better in the sense that I was able to pretty easily push through um, through Dark Elves before um, the um, Hesrathian forces started attacking me across this bridge. And also now I'm starting, I'm starting to tee up some static defense here. Um, I wanted to explore along the upper left. I did check over here. Weirdly enough, it sort of feels like lumber is in a bit of short supply on this map. So we already harvested through that. So I just wanted to explore a bit more. And then you guys just clean up whatever's left on this map and then send these guys back and my army will be in my base now for when that first large attack comes in and across that bridge so you guys yeah you know what? you can keep getting you can keep getting repaired that's nice and i'm just sort of curious i mean i was just curious what was up here so let's look just a lot of dudes just blast them that's a pretty good ultimate just like a pretty good chain lightning honestly these two heroes are pretty beefed up I gave uh, Galareth the, the parry apt because I felt like he would benefit pretty decently from that. And then Ornassian got the Crown of Kings uh, that dropped out of the, the enemy uh, base. Okay, go ahead and take this. And again, I just basically we could just get like a Halls of the Dead at each of these locations because what it will do is it'll just allow us to, number one, make workers, and number two... Um, have some mild defense against like those occasional air attacks that might come and attack us we'll see i mean i've just been sort of used to that in arcane is like our air attacks i don't know how they'd get around us or our allies first enemy attack coming in but we are much better prepared for this this time i think i suppose i'm concerned about this guy and we can't death coil these 
enemies, can we? Don't worry, reinforcements have arrived in the form of statues. Just keep stomping, buddy. I would love to get more Death Lords. They're very good. And my heroes are nowhere close, so I'm gonna... I guess just keep looking around up here. Stomp. Yeah, these... I mean, we have a very, very powerful defensive position here. Very, very strong. Feels good, man. I tried death coiling these flesh cutters, but you can't because they're mechanical. Oh, anime dead. Oh, can I... Can you dispel these or anything? Because that's rough. I don't think there's anything we can do about this. That's a, that's a challenging ultimate to deal with. Uh, I'm just going to keep exploring up here. This is promising, I suppose. Let's go up here. Lord Arnassian, is it you? I don't have any idea who you are, and I don't care either. You belong to the Soul Leader Legion now, and that means I want to rip your heart out. And you won't mind if I take a few parts of his body for my research? Excellent! I cannot wait to see the results of merging the brains of a demon slave with the backbone of a demon dog that was implanted into a sludge creature. Flippin' weirdo. Stop, stop doing that. Ooh, what'd we get? Orb of Demonology is really nice because this guy it doesn't have an orb. Rune Bracers are trash. Get rid of them. A Medallion of Courage. I think we could drop the Pennant of Energy. And... Now Galarith is looking pretty nice too. Both of these heroes looking pretty good. Let's get these guys back home. Everything everywhere is a spirit tower, as it, as it should be, as all things should be. You guys come on up here because I prepared some... Lumber harvesting for you. And as I mentioned, turn you into a Halls of the Dead. Get this saturated, and then we'll turn this into a Halls of the Dead. And now we're cooking with gas. Okay, we've we've explored quite a lot of the up we've explored the entirety of the upper map. I could get a shade or something. I'm not a fan of the anime dead when you can't you can't really engage with those enemies. Upgrade. Is there anywhere else that is some okay lumber? Like, this is an okay chunk. We might have to start stealing from this down Our here. Town is under oh my gosh, Row here, Nexus. Going crazy with the air attacks. I love it. And then Urshan, what are you doing over here, buddy? Just making stuff. He's doing fine. Do we want to attack with our allies, or do we want to attack down the middle? Invaders? I haven't I haven't found a building from which I can rebuild you, so you're kind of precious. I mean, let's be honest, we're not gonna. Yeah, it's fine. Like they have some interesting abilities, but they're not good enough to to bother, so I'm not going to. Uh okay, do we wanna try let's start pushing into the castle proper? Let's go ahead and go. All right, let's quick save. So yeah, I mean, a big thing was we just didn't even bother with anything else. We just came up here, took this very fast, and we had plenty of time to take the upper left before any enemies started getting to us, which is you know, obviously the, where a lot of the pressure was coming from. I'm leaning towards a lot of twin dragons. They did really well for me in attacking the upper bases. I mean, they, they die pretty fast, but like they, they do it for me. They really do, so... Let's go ahead and get a few more of these set up. Start making more of them. Did we get rid of those things up top? It seems like it. And I've been meaning to... I mean, so the Death Guards can be healed by the Obsidian Statues and our Death Lords. So that's another reason why I think that they are going to be a bonus over the Ardaz Nexus ones. These uh, Flesh Cutters. Like, I, I've been building some of them now, but, like, it's mo I, they have cleave, which is cool, but otherwise, you know, not really that important. I mean, they're magic immune. I mean, they only have 660 HP. Is this... How you doing over here, buddy? Are we... Okay, hang on. I've just noticed I, I, several things are clicking in my brain right now. Now another thing clicking in my brain right now. Which is, number one, they teleport on top of us. 
I don't love that. Heal me. No more hiding, Israthian. Face me and die, traitor. I, I feel like, I think we're, are we pulling their, I think we're pulling their defensive force onto us by standing in that. We were both pawns in Ibira's game, Onassian. Firstly, Sara, then you, now me. Cursedar may be next. I hate to admit it, but she's played us all against each other. To what end, I do not know. I think I have to go back. Those that air that air group is was huge. So many things are going on that I need to address. Number one, fallen knights of calm. And uh, upon looking at this, am I? Is this? Is this calm? Right? This was the... This was the Darkmind clan? Right? And this was the Deathbreeze clan? And this was the Boar Regiment up here? Ain't no way, bro! I think... I think that's... What tipped me off was when I saw Fallen Knights of Calm. When I, I was in here and I was like, this is weird. Like, this seems very similar to something. And then this was the main expansion that you take. In the original first orc book, you walk Zermak up here. And he blows an entire base up because he's a Chad. Okay, Twin Dragons can't attack air. And the air attacks seem quite large. So this is something we have to keep in mind. We're going to make a lot of units here to repair. I, what's the, is there a word, is there an emotion for where you're like, you find something silly, but you're also mad about it? <laughs> what's that called? Because that's how I feel right now. Something trumping you. He, uh, Thy bidding, master. He ma he's making us siege it again. You never thought, you never thought yes, master. that Shar's evil could not, uh, could not stretch what even further. And yet here we are. I wish Siege of Calm again. Yes, Master. Oh. oh no, 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 no. I will be done. I can't believe he did it. I can, actually. Never mind. I can completely believe that he did it. Am, am, is it? It is. I mean, these bridges are new. But. It, it is Siege of Calm, right? <laughs> So do we want to just attack through here with our allies, or do we want to keep coming through the middle? So the the enemies are going to attack us down the middle, and if you get too close to that warp gate where they warp to attack you, which I don't love, I don't love that they can just come through the center like that, um, then... Hang on, just let them, let them come across the tiny bridge. That's why we have That's why we have all this stuff. We can attack after this. This might be a two-parter. It's calm after all. I, I th it is. I mean, I, I'm talking like I'm like confident it is, and now I'm concerned like it's gonna turn out that it's not actually. But I'm I'm pretty sure it is. I mean, besides the infernals, I think the twin dragons are gonna do great here. The flesh cutters having cleave is nice. 1,200 HP and 11 armor. 950 HP and 9... Okay, so, I mean, so there's a minor cost difference, the supply difference... They're, they're too close to not be too supply apart, in my opinion. That's my thought. More meat wagons. Everybody just rally to Ornassian. And let's go... We want to come down in this direction. And it looks like Maya is making some, some waves. That's towards where the dwarves used to be. And he's, he was talking about raising corpses in the ruined castle. It is. It's it's flipping comb. <laughs> you know, the original books all had like a little, like, cha not a little, like a, a like a meme, almost like a meme difficulty challenge. First human book I think was probably the uh, Green Wave. Sec our first orc book was definitely, without a doubt, Siege of Comb. So it's funny to see it just recreated like this. Okay, this guy is invulnerable to my my twin dragon attacks. More 
Get some of those fallen angels. This is saturated, right? Our forces are under attack. Uh, I think we're gonna need to destroy these towers to rally and such. We're getting rid of them real fast, so that's no problem. Ooh, they're good against buildings. Look at those. Okay, kill this guy. No lore for a while. Hesrathian, the strategic mind behind the invasions of the Soul Leader Legion, is backed into a corner with no allies to save him and his most powerful lieutenant's dead. The desperate Dreadlord has instead turned to the art of necromancy to bolster his ranks. He will soon, fi soon find out that neither the walls of his castle nor his new army of fallen knights and orcs will save him from the wrath of the Destroyer. Fallen knights of comb and dead orcs, yeah. Okay, am I... I thought that Gardon rebuilt Castle Calm. Or is it that he rebuilt... Did he rebuild it somewhere else? Because, like, the thought that... <laughs> it's it's almost silly to imagine that he rebuilt it and then they got owned again. It's, like, almost depressing. <laughs> yeah, undead... It makes sense. This is the undead dwarven base. If we can maybe make some room here for Lysara... Not Lysara. Oh, my gosh. I was thinking Hisrathian, Ibyra. You know, the taunt about Lysara. Just focus on these structures, please. What is it now? For now. Something troubling. And I don't know where the defensive force is, but if it's not bothering me, then that's fine. Okay, there's the defensive force. I've had better flame strikes. I'll I'll be the first to admit. There have been better ones in my life. Attack that. And then just go straight for the Demon Gate, because those have so much HP. Let's get some Fallen Angels. Oh, my al my reinforcements are going to go through her base. That's okay, actually. That's fine. Just have them on auto attack, though, so that they actually are hitting the defenses. Not enough mana here. I thought I built some Obsidian Statues. Maybe I'm not rallying? Do I have units back here? No. Where shall my blood be spilled? This is a... I mean, yes, we're... Master. I'm making the same mistake I did when I had to restart, which is I've just left my base, and we know that they can just teleport here and attack me. I mean, we have to get rid of these outer bases eventually, right? So, I think this is fine. Does anybody have enough mana for a big heal? Almost. Almost that one. Okay, chaos damage units. Just attack the demon gate, please. If... Maya attacked now, I would love her forever. But I don't. I know that's all she wants. She wants my eternal love, but she's she's not she's not giving me what I need right now, so. There it is. Okay, cool. Just go for the black citadel, please. I I kinda I was gonna say, I, I kinda wanna back up because I was sort of expecting this. I don't have an easy way back into my base either. We just have to run. I can send my air units. This is another reason also to make air units, because you can fly over these walls pretty fast. And while we do have a really nice choke point here, uh, yeah, the the knight, the knight, the dead, the death knight heroes should have tipped me off as well. That's uh, that's definitely something. Oh man. Oh. Did he just death pack to flip in uh, Infernal or something? Good work. They, he animated dead two of my acolytes, though. I can't, you know, I'm not mad about that. Ooh, why am I, uh... Somebody must have cast... When we went through Maya's base, she must have cast, uh... Anti-magic on me. Maybe we'll, uh, maybe we can find Frank, and he will, um, he can sell us some good items. I mean, my heroes have pretty good items, and I'll be honest with you, I, I have no, I had no idea that we would be getting Galarith on this mission. He's like, he's the one hero I did not expect to see again. I see it. I'm like already mad about it. <laughs> I see the tome. Just chill. 
Oh, there's anime dead, man. It's everywhere. Okay, the important thing is this base is gone. Send all these folks home, because we have to- we have to clean this up. We have to... Oh my gosh. Yeah, I- I'm not a fan of the enemies teleporting such that you can never cut them off in their attack route to you. The best we can rely on is our allies. Oh my gosh. Dude, Hesroth, Hesrothian's gotta F off here, okay? Use your ult before you die. I'm, try I'm trying to get him out, he's stuck. Reinforcements have arrived. Get my heroes over here so they can get healed. Stack the heals. Stack, stack the heals. Yes. Yes! Okay, everything's, everything's fine. Everything's, everything's okay now, right? Well, Galarith died, but otherwise everything's fine. Okay. Pr pretty hard when the enemy attacks are stacking up like this. Pretty hard. You know what I would love to see? Lady Maya helping me. It's a rhyme. Wait a minute. That rhymes. Somehow I'm out of gold, too. Can this guy please die? He's been in my base for legitimate years. He needs to go. He's the problem. Never mind. He's gonna live, and he's he has no he has, he's not having any problems. He, they're 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 wiping me. What can I do? I spent all my money too. Another rhyme. Fine. I guess this is our base now. Great. Here, start making this into a black citadel, because we're going to need that eventually. And then get me a graveyard over here. Okay, we can build in the castle now, too. Again, this, this teleport is kind of straight-up garbage. Yeah, the fact that that was a stacked enemy attack was, again, there's really not much I can do about that, frankly. Um, did they, surely they killed the altar in this base, right? Did I, maybe I attacked the wrong, the, the wrong base. Maybe I should have gone the other way. I, I'm really not sure. I think green has left, so this is maybe an opportunity. Two people can death pact, you jerk. Okay, I'm alive. I lived, bitch. The enemy turned around, so, I, you know, I'll take my blessings where I can get them. Sheesh. My fate is sealed. I will be done. I gladly Basically, I feel like you have to have your whole army here every time they attack, which is not a thrilling prospect to me. I have better things to do. Our town is under attack. Okay. I have better things to do. Okay, Lady Maya, I need you putting some pressure on him, girl. Let's get a move on here. 
Empire. How is this man not dead? How is this man regenerating faster than we can kill him? I don't understand. Okay, jeez, oh man. Does flame strike work on air units? I don't think it does. Make some panic at gargoyles. I got plenty of money now. over here. We gotta go for that left base next. Urshan's making a move on it. Every time we destroy a base, that t obviously takes a ton of pressure off of us. What are we at? About 46, 47 minutes? Yeah. Just zap them. Yes. Yes. We're fine. Everything's everything's fine here. If we can stabilize, we're gonna be okay. If again, the fact that we can make these guys—they're they're really good. We just need to lean more into those. Whew, okay, what a. You know, at the beginning of this, cons you know, I thought this would be—I thought this would be kind of easy. I'm going to be honest with you. Like, we took out these top two bases, and I was like, "Oh, we're doing great. This is going to be fine. This is going to be no problem." Then, <laughs> oh, oh, we could set up a base in here, though. That might—that might cause them to attack in here rather than down the center through the way gate, because they see the way gate as the fastest possible path to a base. But if we set this up, that might be what they consider the closest. I'm not sure. Don't turn around. You're doing so good. You were doing so good, buddy. Keep it up. All right, I'm going to wait for the next round of attacks on my base. We're going to wait for those. Then we're going for the left base. That's, I think, how it, this needs to go. Okay, and I'm getting I'm getting some safety black citadels. We got one back here. We're going to get another one. And again, we're looking for safety trees, too. I mean, we've got a lot of trees here. I think, I think we have to take this base. And then this is the main... It just says destroy the base of Hisrathian. Do I have to even kill the others? I mean, I probably should, but, like, do I have to? <laughs> you know? Okay, yeah, that was, uh... There's It's surprisingly challenging attacks, and we need a lot of poachers because there's a lot of air units. Trees? That explains why there's so few trees, too, by the way. It all makes sense. My life for Nezul. Yes, master. Because we've already harvested through all the trees. Do you not see okay, well, there goes Maya. A little late! Oh my gosh, really? Twin dragons, go! Lanira Nexus strikes Where shall my strikes from the grave. Okay, here we go again, but our army and heroes are here. So, in theory, we'll be okay, except they're gonna mana burn us to death, which I don't love. I can't tell- I, th I think channeling Plague with, uh, with Galareth is probably more efficient than just having him auto-attack. Yeah, see, like, once we get him pinned in here with the static defense, you know, just packing away at them, it's no- there's no problem, but... Okay, good work, buddy. Just keep keep spitting some acid. I suppose we should probably stop here. Because I don't know how much longer this is going to take, but if I rebuild this whole base in here and then we've got three more bases to destroy, that probably will put us at a cool two two videos. So let's, uh, let's go ahead and do that. Thanks so much for watching. We've had some ups. We've had some downs. My life it's, a, it's a very exciting... Uh, very exciting mission, a lot's happening here, and it seems like no matter how much static defense I set up, we're never really going to be safe at home until we start putting some offensive pressure on the enemies. Cough, cough, allies, please. Let's get a move on. Oh, he's stuck. Anyway, we'll get this set up next time. Bye bye